Call hello, Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai. Which is all praise on the glory to Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai. Shalom to the house of David, which is the elect that Yahweh Shai is coming back to deliver in these last days. Um, basically, um, you know, this uh, UFC fighter named Jared Kananir, <clears throat> he just fought today. Um, some guy by the name of uh, Eon Katu Katulaba. Um, basically, the brother Kadar had mentioned that he saw it, and at the end of the fight, he had saw this uh, this guy um, do something, you know, uh, which was no, no, uh, noteworthy of mentioning. So I'm just gonna play this clip. This isn't this isn't the fight that he that he fought, but clearly, you know, he uh, basically knows he's an Israelite, okay, and he knows the name of the Lord, all right, because at the every at the end of every fight, you know, that he wins, he. Um, takes out a uh, like a little handkerchief with the name of the Lord, you know, in the um in the Assyrian Hebrew. Okay? Which letting you know that our people are waking up, man. You know, this word is getting out and, and it's, it's 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 we have to end this thing, man. This is what we've been talking about, man. Israel waking up to who they are. Okay, that's a prophecy right there of our people, you know, coming back to their nationality. All right, coming back to who they are, coming back to who their power is. All right. So I'm gonna play this clip. In the first round, yeah. Cannoneer sends Asker right to the This mat is from uh, April, early with this year. Left hand shot. Cannoneer takes his time getting to Asker to finish him off with some nasty elbows. Saucy Cannoneer wins by TKO. Yeah, once he got him down there, it was all formality, Tyler. Yeah, hammer fist. Good night, everybody. See right there, he's holding up um, a little handkerchief that says Yahawa on it, all right? Which lets you know that that's the name of the Lord, man. And and right there also lets you know that, man, this this guy has to been either have to came across the camp or have been watching the videos on YouTube, okay, because that's the only way that you're gonna you know come across come across that name, man. All right. Because the, the Jewish people, they don't call on the name of, of Yahweh, all right? They don't even say Yahweh, they say Yahweh, or a lot of them don't even say that. They just say they say God, you know, and they put the dash in between you know, the uh the G and the D. So the only way you're gonna get that true name is from the the the, the uh the prophets out there, all right? So that means he had to come across come come across, you know, uh, a, a Hebrew Israelite camp that is actually teaching the correct name of the Lord Yahweh in the name of his son. I'm gonna get this um a little better picture of it, you know, right here. This is him holding it up. Okay, you got the fringes, you see right there. The Syrian Hebrew, Yah Ha Wa, okay? That's the Hebrew right there, man. All right, our people are waking up, man. And, and this is a beautiful thing, you know, because he's showing this, and this is the Lord, you know, he, he he's on a uh, international stage, okay? And at the every at the at the end of every fight, you know, this picture is being a, a, a iconic picture of his, okay, that he's uh, holding up the name of the Lord, man, giving praises to the to, to the Heavenly Father, Yahweh, all right, which the scripture says that blessed be the Lord, you know, Psalms 144, blessed be the Lord, Yahweh, that that teaches my hand to war. Okay. And he just uh, beat, you know, this guy right here that comes dressed up as the hawk. He calls himself the hawk today. Okay. December the 3rd, 2016. He just beat this guy that calls himself the hawk, which is an Edomite, man. All right. I believe he beat him in the first, uh, no, he beat him in the third round, I want to say. All right. But. You know, I just wanted to pull the scripture out because, you know, this is very uplifting, man, that that this this is the time that we're in, okay? You got so-called, you know, athletes, so-called people that are, you know, celebrities that are, are of Israel that are waking up to who they are, you know? Not to not to forget the the, the brother that was uh, in the Olympics, okay? He was rocking the fringes, okay? And he called upon the name of Yahweh, why Yahweh shy, all right? He was the bodybuilder. So what, man? I just showed you that our... our uh, our people are waking up to their remembrance, man, and, and that's the signs of the end time, all right? So this is uh, Baruch chapter uh, 2, verse uh, 30. It says, it says, For I knew that they were they would not hear me because it is a stiff-necked people, but in the land of their captivities, they should remember themselves, okay? And that's exactly what's happening. Our people are remembering who they are, which are Israelites. They now call themselves Negro, Latinos, African Americans, okay, Native Americans, the elect. They're remembering themselves as being Israel, okay? And that name has a very powerful name. That's why Esau, okay, the so-called white man, has did all he can to take that uh take that name out of 
out of our remembrance, okay? Take take that name because if you don't remember who you are, you're not going to know who your power is, okay? The living power, Yahweh and his son, Yahweh Shai, verse 31. And, and shall know that I am the Lord, Yahweh, their power, for I will give them I will give them in heart and ears to hear, and they shall praise me in the land of their captivity and think upon my name. Okay, so that's what this this guy Jared Conner is doing, man. All right, he's a uh, he's he's a uh, praising the Lord in the land of his captivity and thinking upon that name right there, man. Okay, read it and read it and uh, weep, Yahweh. All right. That's the that's the name in the Lashawan Kodash of the Heavenly Father, man. That's the name that we must call upon to be redeemed out of this place, man. Okay, and the Lord put the spirit on on this guy right here to uh to show this name to all of the world, man. To pro to, to proclaim the name of the Lord, man, in the land of His captivity, like the, like the Scripture says right here that we would do. I'm gonna read 32 again. Okay, it says, and they shall praise me in the land of their captivity and think upon my name. All right, so, you know, man, we almost out of here, man. All right, people are waking up. This word is getting out. Okay, call Halal, Yahweh in the name of his only begotten son, Yahweh Shah.